Hi, this is Patty Jackson. On this edition of Patty TV, we've got my girl Lettuce. How are She's you? Beautiful. So I are love you. her. Pieces of me and Bravo, and I sit in the studio and I'm singing it like like I'm you singing it. <laughs> She's got a fabulous new book out, Better Than All Right: Finding Peace, Love, and Power. Isn't it beautiful? She teamed up with Essence for this book. Let's talk about this book, which was more personal than I thought it would be. Yeah. Some parts like really touched me, and I said, "Wow." You really opened up. You really opened up about a lot of things. Yes, I wanted the audience to, you know, I'm a good concealer. I love mm -hmm. hiding things, but, you know, I had to be transparent. When you're an author, you have to write and be brave, like Maya Angelou, Liliana Vincent, yeah. all these wonderful writers that I admire. So I just, I am what I, I aspire to be. So I went ahead and wrote a book that, with essence that is in a journal form so that people can come into the world that I'm in and also see some of my experience and be interactive. I love that you can write at the end of each chapter. You can well. write at the end of each chapter. My favorite part, because as you see, I like put it down yeah. here. <laughs> when you talk about real friends, there's a lot of great quotes. It's a lot of things in here that will make you think. How did you come across? Were just like some of the people you like their writings and what they said? Yes, I wanted to incorporate everything that I love and, and people can see that I have great people that helped me and lifted me and I didn't do it on on my own and yeah I love uh, Michelle Obama, President Obama, Nina Simone is one of my favorites yes. and I mentioned her mm -hmm. twice in the book and yeah. In this book you talk about the rejection. First of all the music business is very hard. We see the glamorous part with the videos and things but the music business is very hard and you talk about the rejection. You talk about beauty. You talk about images because everything is so cookie cutter and you're not cookie cutter. You are a unique and beautiful woman on your own and you and you really get very personal with your stories in this. Yes, I talk about beauty. I, every day I tell myself I'm beautiful because the world says something different and I put that in the book because it's a mantra that I say to myself because my mother would say all the time, you're so beautiful, stay off your knees, you're gonna mess up your knees because I would crawl on the floor and run around mm -hmm. and she said, you're a beautiful little black girl, you know, and then when I went into the world they thought something different. So we have to hold on to the root of who we are. I talk about the root mm -hmm. as well. That's why the family part is so important, uh, to never forget who you are, where you start. And it starts at home. Everything starts at home. So basically, what you want people to get out of this book, because it's a must for your reading portion, <laughs> is to really hold on to that sense of self. And you said how important home is. Yes, home, self, love, faith forgiveness, everything in that book I talk about, it, it will help. I hope it inspires others, especially women of color. I really want us to understand how uniquely divine and animated and fun we are and giving. We, get, we have so much to give. I love Lettuce. Isn't she beautiful? <laughs> Sunday, June 24th, you got to get your tickets for a concert because she's going to be in town at the Keswick Theater along with Eric Benet. This has got to be an exciting I, tour. I'm so excited about my tour, <laughs> BGTY, and Eric Benet is there. Hello. Yeah. Doesn't get any better than that. <laughs> a Lettuce experience. For those who haven't been, you're going to get your tickets and you're going to be there. What can they expect? They can expect a show. They would expect something I would want to see and pay good money to see. Uh, quality. Definitely mm -hmm. quality and a lot of singing. A lot, of a lot of singing. You're yes. going to hear all of your favorite songs. I'll be jumping up when she does the Bravo. <laughs> but it's Sunday, June 24th at the Keswick Theater. Get your tickets and get your book. Better than all right. Finding peace, love, and power. There's great photos in here. There's great affirmations and inspiration and great stories as she talks about her life. It's the beautiful legacy.